Last time on Corpse Party. Whoa, 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 wrong intro, wrong intro. Let's continue anyways. Come on, Naomi. Let's go. Right. Classroom 1A. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to go get that board. No, we're gonna have another conversation? Wait a sec. There's an earthquake going on, of course. No, no, you're right, no, it's just the cameraman. God damn it. Another earthquake? No, no, just the cameraman. No! See, see, she knows it's the cameraman. Is it over? Phew. I've had enough. Let's just get out of this room. It's a start. Huh? What? What's wrong? This hallway looks totally different than it did before. M maybe the earthquake made more of the floor collapse. Yeah, maybe. I think what she just said, I don't even think that's possible. Well then, at least that's I'm capable of going that way now. What about down here? No, nope, the same. Okay. Uh, where am I going? Oh yeah, the stupid board. Huh? Hey, Naomi. We're gonna have a nice little conversation. I already see it. Hmm? Is something wrong with your leg? Oh yeah, I was so freaked out I forgot all about it. I think I sprained my ankle when I fell. Well, that's not good. Will you be okay? Probably not. But I can walk at least. I'm sure it'll heal on its own. Yeah, but you shouldn't push yourself. Here, lean on my shoulder, okay? Okay, thanks. What a good friend. There's a loose board lying on the ground here. Take it with you. Yes. Required loose board. Now, please hold while I find the uh, one with the video or my voice. I'll switch that later. All right, we go down first. The gap is relatively narrow here. It seems crossable, but a little too wide to risk jumping. Hey, Naomi, what about that loose board we found? You think it would support our weight? Like a bridge? Eh, I don't know. It seems kind of beat up, but I guess it's pretty solid. Let's try it. Perfect. All right. And now we're going down. A candle, huh? This candle. I could, I could swear I've seen it before. Yeah, that, that was just to save the game, okay? You didn't see anything. Even though I probably cut it out for you. <laughs> no, it's not really that funny. I wonder which way to go. Probably that way. Such tiny shoes. This really was an elementary school, huh? No. I mean, yeah. You and you and the others must be getting. Oh, her brother or sister. That's who she's talking about. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Your father's working late tonight, isn't he? Yep. All those mouths to feed don't come cheap, after all. Giggity. And while Dad's working to put some food in him, I get to be the house fra. <laughs> yeah, I guess you and them are still just little kids, so somebody would need to be around. You're pretty amazing, Seiko. High schooler and mom, all rolled into one. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Why did she have to pull out that face? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I just have to get back to them, though. Guess it's the same for you, too. Your mom's waiting for you, Naomi. 
but we'll make it back. I know we will. One way or another, we'll get out of this place. You bet. Hey, let me put on these shoes. They look good. I can't wear them. God damn it. Wait. Entranceway. The heavenly door is firmly shut. It seems unlikely or unwilling to open through a normal means. Push! Use your girl powers. No good. It won't budge. Didn't feel like it gave at all. In fact, I don't think we'll be able to force it open. Man, so close and yet so far. Well, guess we better look for another way out. Yeah. Well, let's try the back door. There's always a back door at a school building, I think. I hope. If not, well, I'm in trouble. Save game? Nah, I already saved it. All right, cross the bridge. Collapso. I guess I'm not going that way. Can I pick up this board? Of course I can. Picking up damn board. All right. Oh, a bucket. Anything in the bucket? There's a yellow fluid congest inside the rusty bucket. What the heck is this? Pee? Ugh, don't say that. You might be right, though. You might be right. God damn it. I can't walk for ship. Place to lose board? Yes. Okay. Wait. Why did I... Why, I was gonna go up there in the first place. Please. Wait. Huh? You say something, Seiko? Huh? It wasn't you? No, it was me. I said it. Guilty. I said everything. And I didn't even read what that says. The stairs beyond this point are piled with rubber. There's no way to. They're, they're, they're chairs. Come on, we can't move chairs? Are people in China that weak? How the hell did Bruce Lee get as strong as he was? Classroom 2A. Uh-oh. Ah! Oh, what's wrong, Naomi? L look over there. Aren't those bones like people bones? Hmm, let's go. Let me be Sherlock Holmes. Eek! What? What? Why? Why is there a dead person here? W wait, let me look at them more closely. Maybe they're not real. Because, you know, they may not be real. Yeah, yeah, Naomi, they're real. There really are somebody's bones. No. Seiko. You two. Eep. Who dares wake me from my slumber? I mean, you two are new victims, are you not? A g g g g ghost. Who, who, who are you? I was brought here against my will and confined, just like you. Where is here and confined? Where is confined? Confined? Do you mean there's no way out? I'm afraid not. This school exists in a reality all its own, cut off from the world you know. So why have we been brought here? They brought you. They're constantly bringing new victims into this school, more and more all the time. Um, technically, they're not bringing anybody in here. They're, we're bringing ourselves in here. We're just stupid people, and we do stupid things. Signless innocents, one after another. Even though that wasn't signless. This is a cursed, multidimensional nexus. Multiple planes of existence, all piled on top of one another. Created by powerful, vengeful spirits. 
closed space, or perhaps closed spaces. You and we, as well, are the unlucky victims of an inescapable abduction. Closed spaces? Indeed. And it seems you two are not the only ones who have been brought here. I'm sensing numerous others. What? Does that mean everybody else is here too? Are they okay? I wonder. So our friends are in this school too? I don't know the exact number, but I do know that others were pulled into these spaces at the same time as you. They are definitely in this school. Oh my god, that's such good news. Naomi, they're here. We're not alone. I don't think that's good. That means Mochita's here, too. I'll bet that makes you feel a lot better, right? However, you cannot meet them. They are definitely in this school, but the space they occupy differ from the space we occupy. If you wish to see your friends, you must find some means of entering their space or bringing them into this space. Even then, escaping is nigh impossible. But at least you'll be able to die together. Look at the bright side. This ghost knows bright things. Seriously, it's bright as hell. Oh, oh god. Is there no way out of here then? You said we were brought here by vengeful spirits, right? Who are they? And why have they taken us? I don't know. Neither their motives of their captures nor a meant of escaping this hell. All I know is that with some effort, you can at least live out your days together in the same space, and that alone is a fate worth fighting for. Two heads are better than one. Your chances and your opportunities are so much greater when working together. Do whatever you can to find a way out of here. Don't end up like us. The door opens. No! What? Oh yeah. Eek! It's a blue chick. Naomi, run! We have to get out of here now! Okay. How is she doing that? Not touching the board. She's freaking amazing. Pant. Pant. Cough. Are you alright, Seiko? Yeah. But what the hell was that? A child spirit? It did kind of glow. I never believed in ghosts before. Is this really happening? There were definitely ghosts in there. First time I've ever seen something like that. Um, yeah, I don't think it's every day you see a ghost. Unless you're Scooby-Doo in the gang. So you saw it too, right? Yeah, and we were talking to it. I just don't understand any of this. Except... That there's no way, easy way out of this for us. Like it or not, we're stuck in here. It's, it'll be okay. Let's just, you know, march on with our heads held high or something. <laughs> yeah, march on with our heads held high. Is this the first time the music's been on? I really haven't been paying attention. A spirit? If you should die here, You'll experience the pain you felt in the moment of death for all eternity. Heaven's completely cut off. No paradise, no nirvana. Just eternal pain. Ugh, why did I have to die like that? Oh, oh, the pain. 
Required unknown key. So we'll find the pain of so we'll feel the pain of death forever. Best not to think about that. <laughs> Note to self, however I die, you know what, just don't die. Because if you die, you're going to feel that pain forever. And uh, that would hurt like hell. Who did that? What the heck is this? Was this here before? I don't know. But it's just a picture, right? I don't know. I'm just, who, who the hell are you talking I don't know. My god, this game is long as hell. The shelves are filled with overflowing with long black hair. Rows of dead blood and neither green on the shelf. Well then. Oh, I'm going to kill you. How nice. Heavenly Holmes Elementary. Notice all faculty and students. You're all going to die. Another note. What am I playing? Slenderman? No running in the halls. Any student caught running will be severely disciplined. Haha, -ha, who's gonna stop me? I don't know if this is considered running, but who cares? Classroom 3A, the door is locked. The unknown key seemed to fit the lock perfectly. The door can now be opened. Oh. Huh? Naomi, what's wrong? I don't know. It's like my heart skipped a beat as soon as the key was turned. I have a really bad feeling about this room. Oh, trust me. It'll be just fine. I mean, it's a locked door. You know what that means, right? Booty. Behind every locked door lies a hidden treasure just waiting to be claimed. Can't you hear it, hear it calling for you? You mean like a booty call? We're going in. We're going to get some booty. Well, uh, we got skeleton booty. If that counts. Eep! Ah, uh, another dead body. A message has been painstakingly scratched into the floor with fingernails. Whatever you do, don't look at the newspaper. I really think we should just leave this room. Something's not right in here. Oh, okay, but I don't know. I'm really curious about that newspaper now. Can't we just take one little peek? Sure, if one person can hold the door open and the other person look at the newspaper, but that won't happen. Heavenly Post, breaking news, serial kidnapping, and in murder. The good name of Heavenly Host Elementary School had been stained in blood today as horrific details on the recent wave of disappearance are revealed. Over the past month, numerous children have gone missing within the town, and authorities quickly turned to kidnapping in the most likely explanation. Now investigators have located the whereabouts of these children, and their findings are far worse than anyone could have anticipated. The bodies of the exconded youths are discovered within the Heavenly Host Elementary School building on September 18, 1973 at around 7 p.m. Authorities further revealed that a male instructor from the school was found with them alive but near catatonic holding a pair of bloody scissors. Each of the corpses appeared to have their tongue something and removed a blankety blankety Q. Mutilations far too grow blockety blockety block with a G to describe. The page is torn in this part in the bottom half of the article is nowhere to be found. How awful. I think I heard about this though once before. Not me. But I guess it did happen long before we were born, so I shouldn't be too surprised. Slam. Oh boy. Oh boy. The door seems fixed to the wall like a decoration it won't open. Heavenly Post. You will never leave this room. Oh boy. There's a candle here, but it's unlit. Damn it. I'd have had a perfect time, a good time to save the game. 
Sab, Sab. Wait, someone's crying? Uh, 918, 418, something like that. Day duty, Yoshiwaza Asuza. Let me out, 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 let me out. I don't think he ever, this person ever got out. Considering, considering you can see his booty or her booty, whoever's booty we're looking at, there's no way out. Oh, what do we do? This is your fault, you know. What? How? Well, you were the one that said, hey, let's go get some booty. And uh, I was like, okay, we're going in for some booty. Hey, see, that's what you got to do. You got to talk about some booty. Oh, man. That scared the crap out of me. Panicked sigh. Hold up. Oh, no. No, it's gone. What is? My booty. The paper Dow scrap I got from Iomi. That's even worse. Oh, that charm. <laughs> she, she says it like it's not important. Oh, that charm. Mine's still in my student ID holder. Crap. I put mine in my pocket and must have fallen out somewhere. That's why I keep telling you you need to put things away before you they get lost. Now I'm sad. Just, she does no she has nothing to say. Hey, another note. Admit it, you hate all your friends. Eventually you'll kill one another. Okay, the first part could be true, but uh I don't think I'll kill my friends. The door. Science lab. The door seems loud and almost like a model. And it's sculpted into the wall, but there's no way to open it. Hey, sir, why are you mad? Sir, sir, I just want to know why are you so mad? Can you tell me? Can you tell me now? Can you tell me now? Can you tell me now? I don't think it's gonna 